Well, a very good evening to you on what is pretty close to an ideal evening for football. There is uh, barely a cloud evident. The world and his wife have gone to great lengths to be here for a match of great consequence and massive interest in these parts. Barely a breath of wind, so the football has no excuses for not being at its very best. The teams I know are pumped for this. They are fantastic scenes in the stands. There is uh, a great sense of drama here, a great sense of uh, excitement and expectation. And this must be amongst the favoured arenas of supporters all over the world. It really does have a very special feel to it. Romania have chosen to go 4-3-3. Jim, how do you see it? Yeah, and the two wide players up front can make the system pretty much succeed or fail. They'll be quite flexible in their creative movement. They like to drift in. At times, they'll mix their game up and, and keep their width. And, of course, they're also expected to track any runs from opposition fullbacks. So they've got quite hard-working jobs. But if they can gain a one-on-one -on -one advantage, they can dictate. We're underway. Kirikesh. Head towards the front men. Cuts it out. Hoists it forward. Tries to locate someone up front. Done very well to intervene. He'll have a go. And it's Bjarnason. Goodison. Sigurdsson, over to the left. Firmly met. He's got options in the box if he gets his head up. Heave to the back post. It's well blocked and back out it comes. Forward it goes. And he's there to cut it out. Well, there's a lot of movement out wide now. Yeah, you can certainly see that. Well, I think it's a move to open the game up more, whether out wide or, or just getting a runner through the middle now. That's just an example of overcommitting, and they're fortunate for the quality of the intervention. It was vital. And here's Sigurdsson. He's got away. Great leap! Oh, just couldn't turn it in. I have to commend the wing plate, but I have to condemn the defending. They've got to stop the cross. And it's played forward. Tries to get it forward quickly. Well positioned to make that interception. And it's played forward. Magnussen. Romania so far providing no real test at all for the goalkeeper. Forward it goes. It's been intercepted and that comes to nothing. Hoists it forward. Questions were asked, but he's given the answers. 
It could be in here. Defenders on the back foot. But Varsen. Sigurdsson. Bjarnason. Gunnarsson. Timely intervention. Little accusatory stare there tells the whole story. Iceland seemed to have chosen a tougher route through the middle. That was easily read and dealt with. That's a throw. Hoists it forward. He's gone for it! Very speculative with little threat, if any, for the keeper. Forward it goes. And he's made sure that that won't get through. Kirikesh. And back to base. Looks to bypass the midfield. And the whistle goes for half time. So another team has broken through, but certainly not for the want of trying. It's been an interesting game up to now, but still goalless. And after 45 minutes, it is still goalless. A change perhaps after half time. The action is back on the way. At least there's always a plus side to a scoreless half. Defences are doing what they should, and it's going to take good imagination to break the deadlock here. That's been drilled forward. Uh, the ball needed to be better there, it's a wasted chance. Tries to get it forward quickly. Cleared away. It's being played forward. Well, it seems obvious that the plan is to, to try and get their passing game going again, but not with that lack of quality. Lovely bit of skill. Swung over. That's a good block, but at the expense of a corner. Iceland are making a change now. And the header! Oh, nearly. This is nothing. Good effort, very good effort. He would have at least wanted to make the keeper work, though. Played in with accuracy. Oh, well intercepted, really alert to the danger. Drives it towards the front. Kirikesh drives it forward. Plays it out to the flank. Goalkeeper's ball. Sigurdsson. Up towards the front line. Oh, good interception. Gets it upfield. And through to the goalkeeper. And it's played forward. And it's played forward. Now the counter. Not long left, and still we await the breakthrough. Tries to swing it in. Dawson. And here's the chance to counter. Well, well played, he saw that coming. And that's a throw in. Ah, oh, now some movement on the bench, and we are going to see a change. So we have a double substitution going on here. <laughs> mm. 
Magnussen pumps it into the area. Oh, managed to get it away. Gunnarsson. Gunnarsson plays it forward. Magnussen. Iceland have themselves a corner, I think. Yes, they do. Tries to get it clear. Has a goal! And he has been fouled there. Forward it goes. Gunnarsson. Magnussen. Tries to get it forward quickly. Well, both sides might have to settle for a draw here, although there's still a chance for one last fling. Defending of the desperate variety. Hoists it high. And that will be the final act. Well, a frustrating game for attackers on either side. They hardly had a sniff. Defence is broadly in charge. And it has finished goalless. Any reflections on what you've seen, Jim? Romania.